What ailments have you cured by putting your patients on a vegan diet? Every known disease. Uh, of course, we're most notable for all of the people that have healed cancer, and cancer is a frightening disease, but still today, cardiovascular disease is the number one killer. Uh, in Western Europe and North America, approximately half the population is going to die from a heart attack or stroke. Even though it's not as scary as the name cancer, uh, that's an easy remedy. It's a lifestyle choice to have cardiovascular disease. I'll give you that maybe 2% of people with heart disease have a mechanical problem, but I promise you that 98% they don't know how to live, by they don't know how to eat, and they don't know how to exercise, and they are stressed. That's why they have those diseases. Diabetes, I've never seen a type 2 diabetic not be able to recover. Again, it's a lifestyle choice. Do I want to be diabetes and be out of control and eat and live like everyone else, or do I want not want to be and become a vegan, exercise, get rid of the sugar in my life, even the natural sugars in my life. So you start to look at diseases, things like multiple sclerosis, things like Parkinson's disease. It's wild, the statistics, when you start to see the increase in these. These are clearly heavy metal toxins that are now attacking the brain, bacteria that are attacking, viral diseases that are attacking the brain. And we've thrown out the ecosystem of the entire planet. And the very bugs that used to take care of the other bugs are no longer there because we've thrown in chemicals into our rivers, lakes, and streams, and into our landfills. And these poor balances have now thrown off. And we're being attacked by the very bacteria because we don't have a stop measure. We don't have a stop gap measure anymore. So these diseases are all correctable. All you have to do is live properly, starting with your mind, starting with the food, starting with the movement and strengthening of the anatomy of the body. When you do that, you start to become, once again, in harmony and in balance. You become part of the uh, resolution rather than the problem. And this is not something I say in some uh, abstract, utopic way. This is something I say as a scientist who works on the front line every day with the sickest people on the planet Earth and see what people are capable of doing once we're willing to take charge of our life again. Wake up.